What is going on everybody? So if you're currently watching this, that means I've successfully grown a beard at the age of 37. Yes, um, I decided to record it um, basically because you know men and males we, we all grow differently when it comes to beards. Let me flip this round actually. That's better. So, so I've still got kind of a baby face. So. Uh, I only grow pretty much just there, moustache and a bit there. Never really get much around the sides at all. So I've got an opportunity to not shave for a good couple of months and try and get through. So I thought I'd document it and see how I go. So as I said, if you are seeing this, it actually worked. If you're not seeing this, then ah, it didn't work. <laughs> so. Most people just think, oh, you know, don't shave or anything else like that, or you can take some, I think it's not vitamin B, uh, probiotics, there's some sort of biotics you can take to help with your skin growth and everything else. Pretty much, they're just small little aids. The only thing that actually works is a good diet. Genetics, um, and if you haven't got that, is time. And that is it. Most research I've done for growing a beard with people with baby face or anything else like that is literally just time and getting over the <laughs> stage where you look like shit and patchy is anything. And for me, it, it's not looking like, <laughs> I won't even say it, I'll just flash up an image. Yeah, you know, I uh, pretty much, as I said, this will grow long. Um, it'll be kind of slightly horrible, um, but the sides just don't, it's never even. That's the main thing. Uh, when you want to grow, you want to have a nice bit of stubble around there, and it's all even, all over, and then you know you're doing good, but it's not the same. I'm sure there's a high percentage of males that are just like myself, say they may get patches there and not there, or underneath, or anything else like that. So, this currently is, what are we at? We're on the 3rd of July, so we're looking at one week so far. This is what this. I think I stopped at last week of June, uh, was the last time I shaved. So this is only one week. I'll try and. So, there you are. tell if this side was the same length of this and as black as that um, I wouldn't be too much worried but it's not so week one we shall see you on the next week see how we get on right we're at week two of this beard growth um, as you can see it's a bit darker definitely and there, especially on the moustache, uh, did get a few greys which I actually plucked up. Um, but obviously they keep coming back. Sides, she just uh, not too bad. As you can see, so right side's always better than the left. See, not much up there at the moment. Um, is your chin, for some strange reason, got a gap. See that gap? Right by there. Um, give that a bit. So, it's still in its ugly ass stage. I have got to the point of, should I trim it? Especially this. Um, but I don't know, I wanted to trim that and that so it kind of evens up, if that makes sense, because it's kind of thick here, but I'm going to still stick with it, see how I get on. Um, not too many bad comments, luckily where I work, I'm not in the public eye, um, so it's not too bad, I'm just I'm working in an office, so <laughs> it's okay, but when I go to the gym and work out, it's kind of like... I want to wear a mask and just hide from it <laughs> but so far so good anyway that's week two done see you on week three
What is going on everybody? We are on week three now. Um, as you can tell, it's got a bit dark around there. Sides are slowly coming in around there. So I've got some new ones coming, so that's not too bad. The other side is still, um, well, you see. Just zoom in there, excuse me. So, so yeah, week three, mm, not too bad. Um, one thing I have been using is this, which basically just, um, it's a face wash basically, but it helps, uh, it basically says it's for follicle hair softener. So it softens it, it's not so stubbly, and to be honest, it does work. Um, I put it on when I have a shower, rub it in, it's just like a white foamy stuff, leave it in for a couple of minutes, um, and I'd say for a good portion of the day, it's soft. Probably, and then throughout the night, it gets a bit drier, because obviously, you sweat generally anyway. So, not too bad week three. Hopefully, kicks in a bit more, especially the sides. They are taking a bit longer, but yeah, not too bad. Oh, and one thing, quickly, um, is the lip. I'm trying to get it to focus, bear with me. So, the lip, uh, long hairs are actually coming too close. Uh, actually on the lip line. There we are. As you can see, there's a couple that are actually really irritating, and you especially get the ones on the side when you laugh and you just feel it. Tempted to just snip it just above the lip line, but no, I just got to keep going to a certain stage and then I can then start messing around with it and shaping it and everything else. So. Yeah, progress is that sections, not too bad. Still feels weird when I wash my face, but need this section and that one to build back up. Anyway, it's week three, I shall see you on week four. What is going on? It is end of week four. So, quick update for you. Uh, it does seem like this is thicker uh, on me. Sides still uh, it zooms in sorry yeah it's not still a bit patchy um doesn't seem like it's gone in too much that side still the same so i did just quickly check back week three to see progress and it seems like the sides I've got a few more extra strands coming through, or they've got darker. Uh, nowhere near as much. This has definitely just got thicker. Um, so that's it, end of week four. This is the longest I've ever gone, but that was only ever with a moustache. So we'll keep going, and I'll keep you guys updated. Yes, rock and roll for week five. What's going on, everybody? We are... Uh, week five towards the end of week five anyway um so i just had a quick look at the footage from week four to see how far it's come along and whew, this definitely has come along definitely more darker uh starting to grow handlebars as they call it um this side see if you can uh, bear with me So, still got that bit there. Just a bit by there. That's coming along. This side is the worst side, but. So, just small bits by there. They are coming through there, actually. So, got some hairs there, but they're not dark at the moment. They're kind of light colour. So, if they were to turn black, that would be full, same that side. So that's week five for you. We shall see you on week six.
What is going on everybody? We are week seven. So I didn't film week five, uh, week six, because um, obviously I didn't want to do it every week. But unfortunately we're at a stage now where I've conceded and I've had it off. So the sides definitely were coming through, so I've pretty much trimmed them off. Um, this is the only thing that actually was growing. Uh, the other bits just weren't catching up whatsoever. So as you can see, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty long down here, um, long up there, but it's probably going to go, um, now I just look like a guy who's got a goatee, and this is just fucking horrible, um, so I'm going to shape it, but yeah, I've conceded, week seven, longest I've ever done, um, had to be done, had to find out if I've got the hormones or anything else to actually make it grow into a proper beard and you know what I haven't some of us have some of us haven't um, or it just takes a really long time but definitely need to give it a go and see where you get definitely I'd say up to 12 weeks is a good point and an indicator to find out if it is going to work as I said seven weeks or the only thing that was growing was this the sides just weren't growing so that concludes that and we shall see you on the next episode Thanks very much for watching. So, this is currently what it's looking like now. Shaped, trimmed off. It was a failed attempt, but it was worth a shot, as I said. So, I definitely recommend you give it a go. And, yeah, each to their own. If you've got the time to do it, definitely. Um, otherwise you're going to look like a complete mess like I did. Anyway, once again, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe. And I shall see you on another episode with probably some news. Catch you then.